Regularly clearing out gutters and downpipes makes for lighter work later on. It stops the system from getting blocked with debris, which can lead to long-term water damage if you're not careful. Right then, Loretta, we've got to clean out those gutters. Up you go. Thanks, Matt. <laughs> Are you going to hold the ladder? Of course. Now, I know you've probably heard this a million times, but ladder safety is important. Do make sure that the ladder is on a level surface, that you're actually propping it up, up against something, which is secure. Also, try not to go up there if it's too windy, and always make sure you've got somebody at the bottom like me, just spotting the ladder and keeping it steady. Okay. Use heavy duty gloves to clear out the gutters. Oh, a plastic milk carton with the bottom cut off makes an ideal scoop for clearing out old leaves and debris. Always move the ladder along the gutter so you don't overstretch. Also, attach your bucket to the ladder with a butcher's hook to keep your hands free. While you're cleaning away, it's an ideal opportunity to check the state of your gutters and check for cracks that need sealing or to see if you need to repair brackets if the guttering is sagging. There, all done, Matt? Good stuff, although I can't see it, but what's good for you is uh, good for me. As you can see, cleaning out gutters is relatively straightforward. For downpipes, it's just a little bit more tricky. You'll probably need to use drain rods. But that said, use this stuff and you won't. It's just a simple mesh which you cut to size, you pop over the top of the downpipe and it collects the leaves for you. And of course, don't forget to pop those leaves on the compost heap. <laughs>